What's going on, Hashtag Burritos Nation? Before you watch this episode, I want you guys to make sure that you guys are hyped and excited for a Christmas, Christmas little thingamajigger that I'm going to be doing special for the 24th, which is, of course, Christmas Eve, the 25th, Christmas Day, and the day after Christmas, Christmas Adam, because Eve and Adam, you get Adam and Eve, I don't know. <laughs> I'm in three episodes in a row, there are going to be special episodes, and it just... Here's a little bit of a hint. It's a big, big box. Oh gosh, oh gosh. So yeah. So yep. Get hyped for that, guys. The 24th, 25th, and 26th of December. We're coming into you with a nice, awesome, like a possum video. See you guys soon. I love burritos. Team Instinct Pokemon Go Hype! What's going on? Hashtag Burritos Nation, it's your boy Rainbow Warrior here. And this is number 18. I think I should have checked before the video, but I'm a stupid idiot and I just made the list. Um, anyways, yep, number 18 WWE Super Card. And in this episode, I'm going to be showing you guys a cool trick. A lot of you guys, probably most of you honestly know, but for the few, few of you that don't know, maybe I'll be... Maybe I'm crazy, maybe I'm wrong, maybe a lot of you don't know this trick, but it's a really, really cool trick to make you win pretty much every single... Why am I having a green cloud? I don't even know, but whatever. Stop doing the strikes, Rainbow. This is a video showing how to get a win pretty much every single time in Elimination Chamber mode of, with all your females and stuff. So, that is pretty darn cool. Um, I, I thought that this would be a trick that would work, and I was correct. I went ahead and actually was in Biggie Dude's stream and saw him doing it. I'm like, well, I guess I was right. It does work. So, that is pretty cool beans right there. Um, and we're just going to go ahead and get straight into it. How do you win every single Elimination Chamber game, Rainbow? Since I started this, I have not lost. And mostly because I play bots, too. I've only played about, like, three humans, and I still beat them. And the worst I've ever won by is 3-0. So that's pretty sick. Player versus player. Rainbow, where are your best cards? Well, let me show you my best cards. Kappa, JK. No! No best cards right there. Those are pretty trash. I gotta say, those are pretty trash. Am I right? They're pretty darn trash cards. But wait. What is this? They're not trash. These are my best compatible tag team of managers. So all you got to do to win, a lot of you guys already know this, you're like, Rainbow, you sound really cheesy right now. And yes, I do. I'm just having fun with the hashtag Brewers Nation because I'm a cool cat and stuff. And y'all are cool cats, y'all cool beans, y'all burrito lovers, and I love you guys. And I'm just, you know, all energized and stuff because I'm happy to be home from work and play some WWE sip card. Anyways, all you got to do is put a bunch of commons and uncommons in to work with comments or uncomments, I just went ahead and like tried to grind out to get some comments and uncomments one day, and I didn't want to worry about just getting uncomments. Just got as many females as I could on the common or uncommon tier. I just did that a million, million, gazillion times. And then you put in your two best um, support cards. Where right? you don't even technically even need two. You just need one. That's your best two stat manager. That's the key thing here. It needs to be a two stat manager support card. So my best two stat manager support card. Um, well, I mean, it's compatible, that's why I choose this, but one of my, uh, two-stat manager support cards, Monster, that's the highest one I have, and it's Jimmy, Mouth of the South, Mouth of the South, Jimmy Hart, so it's pretty cool, gotcha, with a double, like, thing, there's my other thumb. <laughs> Speed and Charisma, 855 to deck, so when I put this manager on, it actually puts it on these guys, and these guys get up to around, like, 900 points in <laughs> uncommon and common tier. So I'm going to go ahead and give you guys a nice little example here. And uh, I actually still go up against common and uncommon opponents. The only time I have any chance of losing is when I go up against a human. And it's only happened, like I've said, like two or three times out of like probably the hundred times I've played Elimination Chamber. Except Elimination Chamber, at first I was not too happy about it. Still not the best because it takes forever to play. But, I mean, when you play a bot, of course, it's not that long. But it's a lot longer than War, but it's still cool. So I'm going to go ahead and use myself. You can see 81, 82, 85, 84. This is a bot. It's, it's SC Game Dad. Pretty sure it's a bot. 99% of the time it is. I'm going to go ahead and use this manager. I'm going to go ahead and choose either one of these cards. It doesn't really matter at all. You can, don't even have to really strategize in this. All you got to do is basically pick yourself your two-stat support card, and you can see 940, 939. You're probably thinking, Rainbow, but what if you get a power toughness match? Like what just happened right now. So, odds are I may lose this game. 
But I'm telling you right now, you when you have a two stat support card and you only get to use one of them in Elimination Chamber, just like in Royal Rumble, um, your odds are you're only going to get the opposite stats like one time in the game. And as you can see, I still won this game because they're still uncommons versus uncommons. So that's pretty cool. So we're winning a nice little six to four, which is cool. I'll give me some nice stuff some more. And yeah, most of the time you get a three stat, which obviously is a guaranteed win for me, considering I'm going to have one of those stats is going to be super OP powered with 855 um, stats higher. So as you can see, it works pretty darn good. I'm not going to lie. I'm not going to lie. It's pretty cool. Two and 857. A little bit different stats right there and it's just yeah man if you guys have so far enjoyed this episode right in the comments below pink mouse pink mouse it up and that's pretty cool i went ahead and a uh, uh, cool guy's uh, uh, stream last night not cool guy me cool guy me is awesome too though check him out uh, but a cool guy's stream last night his name was alan i believe ah, i really hope i'm right he actually commented on my video for yesterday's video too and it's just really really cool i didn't uh <laughs> He was the only one there on Twitch uh, doing SuperCard. I, I really want to watch a Twitch streamer. I'm like, oh, cool, there is one person. He just seems to be a really, really cool, uh, chill guy. So if you see this video by any chance, I'm sorry, I can't talk right now. i got to think of words to say. Words, Rainbow, words. If you see this video, bro, make sure to let everyone know in the comments below what your Twitch is so they can all check it out. Big Al, yeah, it was Big Al. Yeah, that's what it was. It was Big Al. It was something Big Al. So that was pretty cool. I really, really enjoyed this stream. Your stream was pretty awesome, like a possum dude. And it was just really cool. All right, so shout out to you. I wish I knew the actual Twitch thing. But yeah. I right, see. So yeah, Blake. We're going to go. We're in the Monster Double Plus, which is cool beans. I got to get on that 110K pack video for you guys, too. And of course, as you can see in the last video and this video, in the beginning and the end of the videos, I tease a nice little Christmas. Not Christmas miracle, almost a Christmas miracle. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, I gave birth to a burrito. Uh, wait, what? <laughs> anyway, it's a Christmas special. And you guys are going to be seeing that. I have a cool package to be opening. Three-day special, by the way, on the 24th, 25th, and 26th of December. So I'm pretty darn hyped to show you guys all those cool cat things right there, baby. And hopefully you all are excited about it, because I'm excited to show you guys. And hopefully you guys enjoy it. I think you will. I know I really, really enjoy uh, opening the package myself. All right, so yeah, we're going to go ahead and do this right here. And we're going to go ahead and do a nice little Jimmy, South of the Mouth of the South, South of the Mouth, Mouth of the South, Jimmy Hart. I apologize for my lack of being able to speak English today, guys. I don't know what's going on. Actually, I do know what's going on. It kind of happens almost every single video, at least every other video. I just can't talk. And then just keep on rambling and rambling and rambling and rambling on. But it's all good. It's all good. Just be yourself. Be your dumb, rambling self, Rainbow, and just have fun. Have fun playing the game you love, WWE. Super card. Yeah, sing with me, guys. Sing with me, burrito lovers. I want you guys to write in the comments below right now. Super card. Yeah, if you want. Uh, and you can be a, a cool, fun idiot like me. <laughs> All right, so yeah, Natalia is giving us a nice little W right there. We're down to three points, and we're going to go ahead and go against this too. So as you can see, it's just easy as easy peasy as pie like this, man. And as you can see, so far I haven't even done a power toughness match. So um, so far I'm just getting perfect games after perfect games. Elimination Chamber is very, very difficult when you don't have a balanced deck. And this really, really helps have this balanced deck too, so... Um, with the uncommons and just using some OP support cards. So yeah, I like it. I like it a lot. Do you like it? I don't know where Midget General Brian is right now. But do you like it, Ultimate Midget Warrior? Yeah, I get hyped about it. I get hyped seeing green and gray girls all around Okay, that's enough of you. All right, stay away from the burritos, man. Those are mine. I don't think the burritos react to you very well, buddy. I'm just saying. I'm just saying. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Anyways, guys, let me know in the comments below where you guys are at in your PvP player versus player modes, elimination chamber. How many points do you have? How many CP do you have? 
Um, and just like how close are you on momentum slots? I've been slacking a lot. I really like war because it's really fast. And you can literally, when you're at work, like what I do, sometimes I'll take it out and I'll just like, like let the game play in my pocket and like I'll win every time because I go up against bots every single time in war. So yeah. Um, but this is pretty cool though using this uncommon common lineup. I really do enjoy it. And that's just really cool beans. Anyways, guys, if you enjoyed this episode, let me know in the comments below with a like, 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 comment, comment, and subscribe, subscribe, subscribe. And I'll make sure to make some more videos, maybe another one today, of some Titan, Titan, Team Battleground Wards, second chance trying to get a Titan, maybe a female pro, who knows? I haven't recorded it yet. But anyways, love you guys so much, and I'll see all of y'all hashtag Brewers Nation later. We don't want no ham and cheese, we just want... Burritos, please. Yeah. Just a quick reminder. 24th, 25th, 26th, Christmas three episode special. Coming to you guys soon. Hopefully you guys enjoyed the video. Let's get hyped.